Hey there, here are your disclaimers. Please enjoy. Do you... have nightmares? Uh, I do. Every time. He... still haunts me after that day. Maybe he's right? Right about what, though? Ugh, those nightmares again. Which day is it already? The head hurts so bad. Ugh. Can I- Oh, I can. I can move. I don't remember where these posters are from. Is this even my bed? The shelf? I don't think it's real. It's alright. Uh, what about the plant? They told me that this flower was some kind of hybrid. That's why I took it. For me, it's just a regular plant. Why were they like that? Eh. And he closed the closet. I broke it once while opening it. Did she lock- Did she lock up the closet? Oh. Hey, uh. Okay, that reflection is a little funky. I'm stunning as always. Uh, we're not even gonna talk about how funky the reflection is. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Hi? Oh! What? Morning, Garfield! Yeah. Morning to y'all, too! Gah. Hugo! Come on, let's hug! Hasn't it dawned on you in all these years that I hate tactility of yours? You said that just yesterday! Just like the day before yesterday. Okay, I'ma head out to the library. You two can go. I'll be right back. We'll be waiting. Yeah. Nah. It's just a cute little Sunday. That's what he... Man, <laughs> that's funky. What is going on? Okay. Go to the library in the other corridor. Uh, Lena's room. Hugo's room. Hugo gets very angry when people come to his door without knocking. Knock. I mean, Hugo's not even there anymore. No one answered. It doesn't seem to be in the room. Will it go inside? I can't just do this? Sure! Why not? Breaking and entering, like... We're just breaking and entering into our friend's room. Why is there an invisible wall here? Oh wait, no, it's just a, it's just a grid. Jesus. Some books. Yeah. Hugo's closet. I won't open it. Anything to say about the bed? About the poster right there? No? Okay. Uh, let's go to Lena's room. Uh, okay, I can't go into Lena's room. That's fine. My sister, Rixie's room. Right, wait, can I go in? No, I can't. I can't, I can't go into my sister's room. Marina's room. Okay, got it, got it. I know that that's Marina's room. I guess we can't go into all of these dorms. This room is completely empty. As long as I remember my stay in boarding school, this room has never been occupied by anyone. Room two? I would just expect room four to be empty. Yeah, yeah, I get it, I get it. Yep, 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 I got it, I got it. Thank you. This room is available for one new person. Right. I don't need to go there yet. God damn it. It's better for me not to go there. Right, uh, let's head on down. It's the first floor. I don't need to go there yet. Wait, what? You said to go to the next corridor. Is it down this way? Am I just dumb? Yeah, maybe. I don't think I need to go there. I don't think I need to go there. I guess it's the same for all these rooms. Uh, ooh, posters. Full wall poster. It invites to join the literature club. Only Silver's in it, but... I also joined to support him. I guess he's glad. Nah. Oh. The library. No one's at a reception. The librarian's desk. Except, he didn't show up in boarding school for two years now. Silver spends so much time in the library, which makes him seem to be a librarian here. Huh. Bugs? These ones are probably about culinary. Uh, should I be honest? Yes. It's hard for me to read books because my glasses text... Because my glasses, text becomes too... illegible. Got it, got it. So you've got, you're, you're kind of like... You probably got an estimatism or short sightedness. Or something? I'm not sure. Oh! Silver has read this book to me, but 
I don't remember what it was about. Ah, wait, is it like for each row or like um, each section of the uh, bookshelf? The dream of a ridiculous man. I wonder, do I seem ridiculous to anyone? Souls of House? Interesting title. I have to read it. Wait. Uh-huh. Does anyone even study here? School books are not particularly popular, though. Definitely not for Rixie. She loves to study. Ah! I don't want to look at this book! What's in the book? What's in the book? I need to know what's in the book! Uh, whatever. Uh, there is a person here. Full wall poster. Invites to join the literature club. Early silver city. How many posters did the literature club put up? How desperate are they for members? Then again, it's just me and Silver. Morning, Silver. Morning, friend. How are you feeling? Yeah, have you slept well? <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. Hope that you are too. Um... Are you alright? I've been having nightmares lately and... I'll tell you about it later, okay? Okay. If it will be more comfortable for you this way. I'm worried about you. Sorry. Yes, yeah, alright. I think I'm gonna go to the cafeteria, cause yeah, I feel a bit hungry. Enjoy your meal. Thanks. Oh, wait. Don't forget to take your pills from hallucinations. They're in the medical cabinet. But I didn't ask for- I know, but I talked with the nurse and nanny. And if the pills will make you feel worse, please, tell the nurse or me. I know you can keep it quiet, so if you need help, please, let me know. P uh Alright, Silver. Thank you. Okay, we're going to the cafeteria. Are we not gonna take our pills? Are we not gonna take our goddamn pills? I feel like that's important. And I didn't think I could actually get back here. Oh, wait. Oh, my God. I'm the new librarian now. Jesus. Oh. Uh, okay. 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 I get it. I get it. Jesus. I wish I was waiting to kind of just, like, speed through some of the text. Uh, especially the ones we've already seen before. But, yeah, that doesn't seem to be the case. I wonder which version of RPG Maker this one's made in. Just a bit curious. Oh. Hey. What's this? Nothing of importance. I don't need to go there yet. Okay, I got it. You don't need to go there. Morning, day, and night. Uh, what time of day is it now? Never mind. You feel how the world around us is cruel and unfair? That there is a lot of cruelty, sadness, and ah, uh, one more time of cruelty. Um, yeah. Life is hard, but hey, know what? I have the most ingenious solution to this problem. Can you imagine it? Every time you feel bad, come to me and I will tell you all sorts of motivational parable. No! Why? Why are you motivational pilled? And then you just won't have time to be sad and feel blue. I will just feel cringe, which is so much worse. There will be so much motivation for you. There will be no room for bitterness. So if you feel that the world is weighing on your shoulders or something, just come to me and I'll give you the most motivational stories of all. I'm always here. Yeah, I'm never talking to you. Like, no, I don't care if you're part of some quest. I'm not talking to you. Trash can? But the trash can't. I need to say hi to everyone. Okay. Hey, cutleries. Someone left a plate. Shall I clean it up? Yeah. yeah I think I should. Nice. Yeah. Where did it go? I, I was still here. Like, how, where did it... Did I eat the plate? Wait, is it in my inventory? I have to take dirty plates to the table near the buffet. Yeah, I got it. Got to put it here. Just like that. Uh, God damn it, there's more. Holy frick. There's so much. Like, can't can they clean this? I, I want to clean. Oh, Garfield. Good morning. How are you doing? Good morning. I'm fine. And you? I think I'm fine too. Um, What are your plans for today? 
Uh, I don't even know. Oh, by the way, they're supposed to bring a newbie today. Really? He's supposed to be in the room next to me. Yeah. Oh, Silver hasn't told me anything about that yet. Well, it means that it's unnecessary for you to know. Marina! Okay, uh, what about this dude? Morning, Disha. How are you? Uh, hi. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I... Uh, I'm fine. Glad to hear. Um... Friendo? Morning. M morning. M morning. Uh, what about you? Morning, Garfield. Morning, Sveta. Alright, uh... Have I spoken to Marina? Back off. Uh... Do you need something? No, sorry. Okay, what about these two lovely folks? Morning! Morning, girls. Now that I've said hi, I can leave the dining room. Wasn't I supposed to... Wasn't there something else I was supposed to do? Am I just procrastinating on taking my pills? God damn it. Like, I'm pretty sure I need them. Oh, hey. Garfield! 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 What is it, Ricky? Oh, I completely forgot about the drawing I wanted to show you. Also, yeah, it's Rixy, not Ricky. Go, go, go! Uh, my pills! My pills! Why is she in such a hurry? My pills! I don't need to go there. I need to go get my pills! I need my pills! Uh, <laughs> I, I don't know what's real and what's not. Um, the fact that she's running is kind of... Hey, hey, die. Go into Rixie's room. Hey. Here. You told me about mice yesterday. Flying mice. Do you remember? Here. I drew a mouse according to your descriptions. Those are just bats. Um. Whoa. Rixie. It's beautiful. I'll definitely hang this masterpiece on the wall. <laughs> By the way, Rixie, there's a newbie that's about to settle to our building. Yeah, I know. I already saw him on the first floor with Nanny. This boy has red hair and, uh, it's also kind of evil. I was afraid to talk to him. Uh, really? Yeah. I'm sure that you'll be friends. Everything will be fine. Even if, even if he turns out to be the most flamey, flamey monster, I don't know what flamey means. He'll definitely protect you. And Hugo too? <laughs> and Hugo too. And every, everyone. Yippee! <laughs> oh man, okay, now what? Rixie's closet, I won't open it. Uh, here? The main thing for me is not to wrinkle anything here. Does she stick drawings on the wall and make a separate picture out of them? Looks really cool. Yeah. What about what's on the shelf? Cool books. I love reading them with Rixie. She loves exploring the world of Daimonium, but I'm afraid that one day she'll be caught by government guards. Oh, you called me? Uh, no, no, sorry for distracting you. Rixie's drawings are very beautiful. Oh, that's on the bed. Funny, which I gave to Rixie for her fifth birthday. I'll never forget how happy she was because of that gift. Yeah, I love it when my loved ones are happy. Nah, now what? All right, I'll go. Okay. Can I please take my pills? So I wanted to do something. Your pills! Exactly. I'll go and find a new... Your pills! Get your goddamn pills! This sounds so strange. Um, can we please get our pills? Please? Please? D -d -d I, I'm pretty sure we need... D -d -d you're supposed to get your pills! G Garfield! Are they still here? Oh, hey, they look cool. Hey. Correct. We washed the boy and patched up his wounds. Nice. What about his name? Flame. He remained silent about the age and origin. Don't they understand that I hear everything? That's all. The guard saluted and left. Flame, right? 
Oh. Yeah? Follow me. I'll show you your room, and we'll fill out a couple of papers with you. Got it. Huh. What's up, doobie? Can I please get my pills now? Good afternoon, Nanny. And to you, Garfield. Hey, I'm Garfield. Yeah, I don't care. Get out of the way. Up. Oh. Well, uh, Rixie did warn me. Can we please take our pills? So I had to go get the pill. No! Finally! We're getting our pills! Uh, I wonder if these pills will help me. Well, there's no one here as usual. Yeah. And here are the pills with a note. Laptop something. Would you like to read the, read the pill instructions? Yes. Welcome to pills instruction. Okay. What happened? Let's take some pills. If you see that the character's mind scale is falling, you need to press the button Q to restore it. If you run out of pills, then you need to return to the medical cabinet and replenish pills from the closet. But why would Garfield take pills? So he wouldn't die, right? Your game is over, you don't take your pills! <clears throat> so you're telling me that this whole time we've been living on the edge when at any point we could have just perished and he still didn't want to take his pills! Garfield! And also, it's better not to take too many pills. Good luck! Uh, that's not my name, and that's not even my laptop's username. The hell? Got it. Okay, I think I got it. The main thing is not to overdose. I am curious about that, though. I'm gonna make a save. <laughs> I'm gonna immediately overdose. The scale is full. Still take the pills? Yes. <laughs> this is completely, um, this is completely, what's it called? Um, irresponsible. Never do this. Uh, are you sure? I, I don't even see any answers here. Yeah, let's do it again. The scale is full. Still take the pills? Uh, Morse code? What? Oh. Uh, looks like what's worth keeping the norm. <laughs> I am just showing this to y'all so that you'll never do this. This is a terrible idea. Also, you don't, uh, you, you just be in excruciating pain most of the time if you even attempt this. So don't do this. This is just for, uh, God, I can't even say this for entertainment purposes because that's extremely tone deaf. Frick. Okay, now what? I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. Maybe you can decorate the pills with stickers. I think I still have a few stickers left in the nightstand. Right. Uh, I am not talking to you. You're going to make me feel horrible. Basement. We're not even allowed to approach it. Huh. Okay. I need to go to my nightstand. Uh, pretty sure my room's number seven. Okay. Nightstand. Nightstand. Put the stickers on or not? Yeah, why not? Or maybe it's better not to. Ah, select your final answer. It cannot be changed. I want to put the sticker! Hey, wait. Did I do a stupid? Am I supposed to not put the stickers? That's better. I hope Nanny won't scold me for no reason again. Oh, boy. I, I don't think I'm supposed to do that. Yo. Hey. Uh, hi? Sorry for being so rude. Um, can we start our acquaintance from the beginning? Well, I don't mind. Nice. In that case. It's nice to meet you. <laughs> Me too? Uh, why do I have a devil's tail? Huh. Can you show me the whole building? Alright. I should introduce you to all the guys. Y yeah. By the way, I've already met Marina and this friend of hers. Lena? Ha! <laughs> You're fast. 
Then I'll introduce you to Silver. He's in the library right now. I don't think I'm supposed to put the stickers on the bill bottle. Wayne joined the party. Nice. Go to the other corridor where the library is. Got it, got it. Uh, uh hey, hi. Hey, hi, kiddo. Uh, what's your name? Are you talking to me? Um, well, yeah. Who else could I talk to? Flame, slow down. He's very timid. What's that? It's just a sissy. Hey! Hey! Um, might want to backtrack right there. So what's your name? Um... Uh, did he just... See, I... He just would... We're not even gonna talk about the fact that he just went through a wall? Oh, come on. He'll cry and that's all. Wait, that's right. That's where the... That's where the court... The corridor? Wait, what? Wait, I went up, right? I went... Uh, what? The layout of this place does not make any sense. Jesus. Anyway... To the library. Yo, Silver. Silver. Ah, this is Silver. Silver, Silver, Silver. Why am I shouting in the library? What happened? No need to shout like that, my friend. Sorry. Meet the flame. Hey, Silver. Tch, hello to you, too. The dream of a ridiculous man. I've read that. Really? What do you think about it? Quite an interesting... novel. I'm glad you liked it, but... It's not really a novel. Sorry. Uh, I screwed him. Okay, I think we'll go. Bye, Silver. See you later. Why am I interrupting them? What? They're, they're in the middle of like a pretty riveting conversation right there. Take care. Why is my sanity going lower? That is odd. Uh, what am I supposed to do now? I mean... Uh, do I introduce them to my sister? Hey, 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 look who I brought. Flame! Oh, you're that one newbie. Well, hello, Flame. Hi, I'm Rixie. This is Hugo and Sveta. Uh, hello, nice to meet you. <laughs> well, hello, Mitch. Hey! God damn it, Flame! Hey! It's offensive! Hey, don't bite my head off. I'm kindly. Actually, this is at least not kindly, but a display of disrespect for those who are younger. Oh. What a nerd you are! Ah, Garfield. Is this purple girl your sister? Actually, yeah. Rixie's my native sister. Well, I understand right away. You two look alike. Yeah, Tots, wanna hear a joke? No. Who asked? I just don't think you can come up with anything reasonable. I apologize. I really wouldn't want to listen to something from the mouth of some punked race on the street. Especially wouldn't want to apologize to one. I think Hugo's right. You don't... Really carry yourself very well. Guys. Oh no. Wait a minute. What are you implying? That's enough. Let's get out of here. And there goes my sanity. Why are you. Why are you like this? Because why is this. Why would I let these dwarves mock me? You started it first! Oh, come on. Screw that. Hey, you have somewhere to chow here? Ugh, I'll show you. My sanity! <laughs> He's gonna kill me! Uh, looks like everyone has already left. Good! No interactions! Oh, what's this? Uh, an apple? Huh. Alright, cafeteria. Cafeteria. Not much of a choice. Uh, yeah, you wanted to eat! You want to grab something to eat, you freaking... Uh, why, why are you even here? Flame took the apple. Did you 
steal an apple? And why? What? Me? Stealing? <laughs> it's just an apple. Um, well, what now then? Not much of a choice. Well, did he at least, like, eat it? Did you see everything you wanted? It's a bit empty, but there's definitely some good grub here, though. Let's get out of here, then. Is my sanity okay? Oh, I forgot to introduce you to someone. I think he's on the second floor now. Uh, my sanity! What's there? Um, this is the basement. No one's allowed to go there. Let's get out of here. Is it really impossible for anyone to go there? Well, probably? Ah, uh, what a shame. Actually, well, I have the basement key, but I've never been there and- Oh, let's go, let's go! Um... Ha! <laughs> you afraid? No. Oh god, what a wimp. I'm not a- Ah, <laughs> oh, well, what else could I expect from you? Sorry, but we really can't go there. What a stupid excuse, Gary. Okay, I'm done. But only if we get caught here now, it it will be all your fault. <laughs> I already like this. And someone really likes getting in trouble. Garfield took out the key and opened the door. I literally just said I wouldn't go down there. Why am I listening to him? He's just getting me into more trouble. You see, there's only darkness and nothing more. Uh, let's see. Can I have the key? But no, do not, do not, do not, Garfield. I swear to God, if you do this, you are the dumbest character I have ever played in a video game. Well, I'm interested. Okay. Is it impossible or what? You can, probably. Don't be such a dweeb. I won't take it from you after all. Okay, here you go. Wonderful. Are you sure? Did I just give it to him? I gave it to him. Why did I give it to him? Why would I give it to him? There's nothing there? Well, how would I know? I've never been there. Really? That means you can just go and... You'll know everything! I freaking knew it! Butthole! My head, it hurts so much. Where am I? Uh, why is the timer going down now? Flame! I should get out of here as soon as possible. It'll be really bad if Manny finds out that I was here. Freaking! But! That pill! I can't take my pills! Boxes! 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 Uh, wait, wait, puzzle? Knife. The same one in the, so in the kitchen, some sort of door behind the closet. Pl uh, I wonder what's behind it. But unfortunately, uh, I can't move the closet from this side. Gah, pick up the knife. You got the knife. Got it, got it. Might come in handy. Frick. Oh, the key. I. That was fast. You got the first key. That was easy to find. Maybe there are more. What did I ever thought? Why, why am I looking for keys? This place smells rotten so much. Okay, I'm about to vomit. Okay, okay. Without, why? Oh, by God, wait, what? What am I supposed to do? Wait, I thought, what is with this box? Oh, uh, okay, okay, okay. It seems there's something behind this rag. What, 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 what did I pick? I have no idea what I just did. God, I got so scared. This is a photo of a woman. Yeah, she looks a lot like Nanny. Okay, she seems to be younger in this photo. Okay, got it, got it. What do I do? I, 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 there's no indication on what to do. There's none, none whatsoever. Uh, okay. God, what, why, what, my sanity, my sanity. Uh, God, God, God damn it. I don't care about the photo. Take the key, yes. Take the key, second key. Got the second key, another key. I hope it opens the door. Okay. The door is locked on the key. I have two. First key. This one is fit. Okay, 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 okay. The door is locked on the key. I have two. Second key. What do you mean it doesn't fit? What am I supposed to do? I don't care about the portrait. Open the box. Yes. Uh, the box contains strange things and the key. Take the key. Yes. 
Uh, okay, okay. Uh, third key. Well, finally. I must suffocate it there. Is it night already? How long was I in there? Everyone should be asleep now. Okay, I'll sort it out in the morning. I'm... Tired. My head still hurts. It's like when I was hit with a brick. But full force. Now I should go to my room. Hell! <sighs> hey, Silver. You wouldn't believe the night I've had. Garfield? Huh? No! Oh, Silver! Uh, hello! Uh, how are you? Wait. Explain what happened to you first, please. To me. I'm fine. Garfield. You're not fine. I'm sorry. I couldn't seem to lie. That's for sure. Get some sleep, please. It's late. Uh, uh, I'd like to hang out with you some more. Um, nope. Okay. It's nighttime. I'm pretty sure this place has a curfew or something. Why are you like this, Garfield? Why are you like this, Garfield? Let's go to the library. Okay. I thought I wanted to go to bed. But why? Why am I like this? God. God, you are the most unlikable protagonist I've ever I've ever met. And I play Coffin of Andy and Lele. My leg. Why? It hurts so much. Okay. Garfield, you just need to calm down. Everything... Everything will be fine. Is everyone already asleep? <laughs> yeah, surprisingly. Why are you sitting on the floor? Uh, does something hurt? No, no, I just decided to sit down. Could you just tell the truth? Are you allergic to the truth? Okay. What do you want to read this time? Um, seems like we haven't finished reading the last one yet. Really? Oh, right. Can I sit next to you? Yeah, of course. Conversations become a real torture for Henry. The boy could not establish relationships, even with his loved ones. He constantly spoils the mood, as some have said. Henry's aggression and cruelty sometimes cross the line. One day, the boy killed his little sister's best friend in cold blood. A kitten. What the frick? Butthole. Sorry, I'm talking about Henry. Can't argue with that. As I remember now, a short and fragile girl was running with a... Little black spot on her arms, which purred only for her. Henry didn't immediately realize the situation. He brutally beat an innocent creature with a brick, and most importantly, a creature which was considered a member of his beloved family. The hell is going on? Being furious, the boy did not even understand what really happened, but the endless tears of his little sister and the fear of children in the yard, the realization of the committed act came. Why is this something that you find comfort in? I mean, I guess some people really like the macabre. The Henry was eager to change into the best side, so as to not to harm anyone else, not to harm anyone at all. Did someone come in? What do you mean? There was a sound. The door opened. I didn't hear anything. Well then, it just seemed... It was very difficult. Gradually, he seemed to begin to go insane. It was as if he was trying really, really hard, to, really hard to hide his aggression, which just wanted to break free again. Henry's sister told me in confidence that she start waking up in the middle of the night. When he cried, he kept repeating one thing. I'm not progressing this. Run. 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 Uh... 
Um. Um. What do you mean, run? Oh. This is fine. This is fine. Ugh. Can't sleep again. Ah. Uh. He's just a voice in my head. I should take a walk around. No, you should stay in bed. Maybe I'll be able to sleep. Um. Man. Maybe Silver's still in the library. That's how I should go check. Um. I don't know if this is a good idea. I don't think he's here. Let's go back to our room, please. Silver? Right here. He's asleep at this point. Ugh. Could have guessed. You're just make yourself even more upset. What happened? Uh, there's... That sound came from the first floor. I hope no one was hurt. Uh, first floor? That's downstairs, right? Wait, this is still in the same corridor. What? Why is my sanity dropping even low? Why don't I just go to sleep? Why don't I just sleep? Maybe it's here. What? Huh. Yeah, I could seem to read that sign. It's first floor, right? Hello? Anything here I should be worried about? He's here again. This is not reality. It's a nightmare again. Run! Um... Ray, uh, ah, Garfield. Good morning. Run, run, run. Ba, I am running. Wait, wait, why, 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 why? Yeah, okay, 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 okay. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Okay, wait a minute. No. What? Why did he spawn there? Okay, I'm going, I am going. Okay, screw you, screw you and everything you stand for. I just need to sit here until I wake up, right? I lost my pills. Damn it. Just go to sleep. You god damn idiot. Just sleep. Maybe hide in the closet. You know, the closet's a good idea. Um, please? Is there anything we can do? Also, it doesn't matter that you lost your pills. It's a goddamn nightmare. Like, dreams. Like, I literally just said, they're just dreams. My guy. My guy. My guy, there's nothing you can even do at this point. Like, what the hell? Oh my god, do I just check on the door? Ugh. Yep, I knew I had to check on the door. You said you were just gonna stand around and do nothing. Ah, oh, okay, here he is. He's approaching you, and your sanity is going lower and lower. You'll wake up eventually, I guess. I guess. Go ahead, perish. Perish for all I care. Go ahead, Garfield. Do you think I care? Do you think I care about your safety at this point? Do you think I care? Go ahead! Die! Ugh. Please don't tell me I was actually supposed to just sit around and do nothing. Oh! I wasn't! Okay! Okay! We'll make another save. Thank you. <sighs> Where am I now? Clearly in another dream sequence. What's up, my dude? Hi. Well. Well, 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 well. Well. Good morning. Good night, dear play. What do you mean? That's not even my name! I'm incredibly happy to see you here. It's terribly boring to be here alone. Oh, would you like to play a game with me? Not really. But you are my guest. Let me entertain you. The game? It's just a game. Oh, 
You're already playing it. As soon as you think about it, you will lose. Oh, it's the game. And the most interesting thing is that it will never end. Wonderful, isn't it? You're, you're just introducing the game to a whole bunch of people. What the heck? Also, I lost the game. And you too, apparently. Have a good game. Uh, I'm hungry. Yeah, I'm sure you are too. We are the whole. <laughs> we are one. Just like a disappearing twin. Well, it's meal time. Come on, choose a tray, dearie. Now you have to choose one of the trays. Don't worry, the order doesn't matter. Remember the numbers you see now. Three, one, four, two. Okay. Three. Dead rat? <laughs> yes, you have good taste, darling. One. So the guts are right there. God, my favorite. Four. Okay. After lobotomy, this little girl somehow began to look at things more simply. Well, just look at her eyes. <laughs> Only if you could see your face now, Gary. I... I don't feel a thing, man. Well, why are you so quiet? Ah. You're just edgy for the sake of being edgy. Like, I don't really have any respect for you. 3142, right? Yeah. 3142. That's the sequence. Empty. Ah, sorry. I couldn't resist and even before you came, I took and ate your little sister's liver. You're not offended, are you? Oh, these are all parts of Seasta. As far as I understand, you won't eat your little sister's head. Uh, I'm gonna throw up. Just try it. Her meat is very sweet. No! Oh, wow! Lol. What a pity. Okay! Hi, weirdo! I need, to find, I need to find a way out before he returns. I think I have a knife in my bag, right? I could use it. Click on a confirmation button to cut the rope with a knife and free yourself. Okay, just gonna... Yep, just... That took no time at all. Wait, the exit is not here. Uh, it's down here. Okay, three, one, four, two, uh, and A-OK. -okay. That was easy. Where am I? Nothing visible. I need to take something that can lie my way. Uh, isn't that... Wait, what's that? Huh. <sighs> candle. Candle? Okay, that's better. Candle. This candle won't light. Well, okay, is there a candle here? No, uh, uh, what do I even do? I can't, I can barely see what's going on. Oh, I'm supposed to light all the candles, I suppose. Uh, here's one. Okay, is this, is there one here? No, no, there ain't. Oh, man, I can barely see. What the hell? Oh, God. Okay, now will it light? It won't light. What the, that, that, what am I supposed to do then? God. Okay, there's one here. Can I light you? Okay, you were just in a really scuffed position. That's fine. That's completely fine. I'm not mad. Just disappointed. Just very disappointed. Can I please leave? Okay, there's another... Is there another candle? No, no. Okay, can it light now? Will you light now? It won't... I don't care if it can't be lit. I can just leave. I feel like there's a candle right there. Yeah, yeah, there is. Okay, is there another one here? It, uh, where are they? I don't know where the candles are. Like, it's too dark for me to see a goddamn thing. What the hell? Okay, is that one here? Here? Uh, here? Okay, how am I supposed to get out? Okay, this is really not clear to me. Wait, is that another one here? No, there ain't. Will you light now? Oh my god. Oh, now I can... 
This is clearly a dead end. I need to get out. Uh... Huh. Yeah, sure about that? Uh, okay, let's get out. Oh, we're back here again. Yeah. Three, one, forty-two, and let's go. And we're here again. Why are we even here? Huh. Wait, this is loop indefinitely. The candle won't fly. Hmm. Hello? Where did I end up? Someone's here. Am I not alone? Yeah. <sighs> Hello. Good morning to you, my beloved. How are you feeling? How are you, dead parents, friends disappointed in you, and how does it feel to live as an outcast? <laughs> Unfortunately, I will never understand you. Joke of the day. In the family of cannibals, the father died. But, he still remains the breadwinner for them. In general, delicious and lugubrious, isn't it? <laughs> wow, that's the funniest joke I've ever heard. Wow, wow. I love your jokes, my man. Wow, God. Oh, man, you are edgier than an edit from the 2000s. You are edgier than a MySpace edit. That's how edgy you are! <laughs> it's like I'm in a real sitcom. By the way, very, very sad news I have for you. Unfortunately, the main guest of today's program ran away. Could you imagine? By the way, right now, he is sitting there among you. He ran away and so brazenly decided to come to my performance. Could you imagine that? Let's find him. <laughs> it seems like it's time for me to leave. Oh, who's that I hear? My guy? My guy? My guy? Oh, hey. Oh, you're a clown. I know quite a number of people who might sim for you if you weren't such an edgy butthole. Found you. Oh, oh, his tone is a lot higher. I thought it was going to be like low and demonic. Okay. Who do I see? Hello, darling. I'm so glad to see you here. Okay, and, 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 let our show begin! With great joy, I can announce that it continues. Let's meet our guest. What's your name? Garfield. No, why are you lying to such a huge crowd? What a moron you are! Do you all know what his real name is? Keller! <laughs> continue! Continue! Keller! Keller! Keller. Yes, after all, this name is a real stigma. Nothing describes our main character better as... Killer! <laughs> correct! Correct! Okay, Killer. We met. Uh, okay, I guess I'm saving. So, let's ask... Henry, a few questions. Ah, uh, dear, you don't mind, do you? Excellent! Let's do the control question. Control survey? Yeah, sure. Wonderful! 
Wonderful. And you, player, it seems you don't even resist. Ah, you are so nice to me. An incorrect answer equals death. Score three points. So, let's start our interview, shall we? Are your parents happy? No. And this is the correct answer! Surprisingly, the beginning went very well. Come on, let us clap for the vigilance of our mediocrity. So, <laughs> very, very, very good. How many questions will there even be? Darling, I'm the only one asking questions here. And for any objections, I'll take off all the points. <laughs> okay, okay. Second question. Is this exactly what you were trying to achieve? <sighs> um, Keep silent. Well... Why are you quiet? I don't know. Don't know what? How to add two plus two? I'm not really surprised. Keep quiet. Ah! Okay. That was the wrong answer, I guess. Uh, what are you talking about? I can ask the questions here! You know perfectly well what I mean. So... I minus all the points! Third question! Are you sure that Silver doesn't know about what you did? He wouldn't judge me. He'll never know. I don't know. As usual, you are. Come up with something new! Whiner! I feel so bored with you. God damn it! I gotta do that again! I guess he wouldn't judge me, or he'll never know will be the right answer. He wouldn't judge me. <laughs> Come on! Laugh! Laugh! One lovely day, even your silver will turn his back on you. There will be no one else you could cry to a shoulder. Right? Oh god. <laughs> what am I saying? He's so poor, unhappy. Well, okay. Let's take pity on this poor boy and give at least a little. Otherwise, he'll cry right here. Question number four. I wonder, how did you even get to it? Just look. With your intelligence, this can only be luck. Well, you know what? I have to agree with Glitch here. Like, Garfield is not the smartest, like, he's... He's not the smartest pickle in the jar. Are your little sister proud of a little brother killer? No. Well, why so? Ah, exactly! She doesn't remember anything. Come on, come on, remind me, whose fault is it? You know it. Do I know? Yes, but do our viewers know it? Maybe the audience would like to ask a few questions. Why did... Why did you kill? Who did you kill? Who did I kill? Who are you... What am I? Will they come for revenge? Where's Robert? Why are they here? Why are you forgiven? Stay. Maybe you'll answer all the questions. They are waiting after all. They want revenge. I won't answer. Well, suit yourself. God, I, I have to do all that again. Ah! Uh, I guess I'll run away. Catch him! No, uh, wait. I don't even know where I am! Please tell me. 
I start from the chase sequence. Please tell me I start from the chase sequence. <sighs> yes, I do. Oh my god. Okay. 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 Uh, okay. Thankfully. No. God damn it. Okay. 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 Yeah, I'm good. Yeah, I'm good. Ah, god damn it. Okay. Let's just try this all over again and hope to God we can actually escape. No! Running, I'm running, I'm running, I don't care, I am running, I am running, I am running. <sighs> so who did I kill? Myself? Yeah. Who is that? I have no clue. I don't know if I even care. Still crying? Go away. You're just a voice in my head. Freaky hallucination. I hate... I hate you so much! When will you leave? Leave. Just leave! It's your fault. So what? When will you... At least just calm down. I just want to visit their graves. You think I can? Just escape then. Boy, never thought about the feelings of those who you were dear to. I admit, but we weren't really dear to them either. You decide to make fun of them again? Okay, okay, but why kill? It's still fun when you do something out of the ordinary. I'm not having fun at all. And what are your tears for now? You're doing well now, though. You got new friends. Became softer. More caring. You know, this is already an achievement. Someday, I'll go back to what it was like then. I'm weak as hell. Stop whining and get yourself together, Garfield. This will continue until you stop it yourself. But only you can stop it. No, it's not me who controls you. In fact, all of this time, you were the one who was controlling me. And no pills will help you cope with yourself. I'm not real. Understand this already. You're the one making fun of yourself. I don't want to listen to you. So leave. Please. As you wish. But who am I? What am I? Maybe he's right. Anyway, that was the Souls of House prologue. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys do want to play this for yourselves, link to the game will be in the description below. Um, that was an experience for sure. Um, I am intrigued by the story. Uh, I still think that the main character is annoying as all hell. And apparently I've got good reason to hate him. Apparently I've got good reason to hate him. But I'm still wondering... What did he do? I want to witness the downfall of the main character, okay? Like, that's my feeling about this game. But anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Hope you all have a lovely rest of the day. And as always, I'll be seeing you in the next video. This is Lion, signing off. Ciao.